Hey guys, this is Cameron with Motion Science back with another super cool tip for you for After Effects. And this one has to do with effects. So let me show you what I mean here. So I've got 12 individual layers here of amoebas that are animating in different ways. And they all look really cool, but let's say the client comes back and says, Listen, I love what you've done, but I want this and three other layers to actually be solid pink. Well, I'd like to set up an easy way in my composition so that I could easily make all of these four layers pink at the same time. And then if I need to easily change them to, let's say, green at a later date, they can all easily change to green at the same time. So if I'm going to make them pink, the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go to generate fill and it's turned red so I'll go to the red color make it let's just say there's a nice pink okay now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna select fill I'm gonna go to edit copy with relative property links and then I'm gonna select the three other amoebas that need to be pink so let's say they've selected this one this one and this one okay now, all I do is go to Edit, Paste, boom, they're all pink, right? So what's great about this is now, let's say the client comes back and say, oh, you know what? I need them green. All I have to do is go to my original layer and change it to green. And all of these layers have automatically updated. And I'll show you what's going on here. If I select this layer, go to the fill effect, you can see that it's using all these expressions to reference back to this layer. So whatever this fill effect does on this layer, it affects all of these layers as well. And this can be applied to any effect in After Effects as far as I know. It can also be applied to the properties, like the transform properties of a, of a layer. So let's say we go back into this layer and I know later on I'm going to want to maybe adjust the scale of all these together. So I would just select Scale, Edit, Copy with Relative Property Links, and then go back to these three other layers and paste. Now if I go back to my original layer and I go to my Scale property, you can see here they're all scaling based upon this first layer. This is just a very simple example of how you can use uh, property links. Uh, you can expand on this quite a bit and it's a very powerful tool inside of After Effects. It can ease your workflow and make things much smoother and make things much smoother and easier to work with uh, in your compositions. So I hope you learned something new. Please like, comment below, let me know what you think. And until next time, I'm Cameron, and this is Motion Science.